does your quality turn from this into this or even worse after uploading on TikTok? Today I will show you how we can fix it. Make sure to watch till the end because at the end I'm going to reveal my own secret that I use for my TikTok uploads. First make sure that the scenes you're using have the right quality. I personally always use 4K quality but HD quality also works. If you are on the lookout for good scene packs or don't have a scene pack account where you can get your scene packs from, make sure to check out my scene pack account. I have loads of different scene packs of different characters in full length. Make sure to check it out. Links in the description. What you want to check next is if you're using the correct composition size. If your composition size looks something like 480 by 720, it's obvious that your uploads are gonna look way more pixelated than if you use, for example, 1170 by 1560. So I recommend you to use a higher resolution because the higher you go, the better the quality is. Also make sure that you put your frame rate to 60 FPS so that you get the final touch of smoothness for your edits. The next step is gonna be choosing the right color correction. I personally recommend you to get my glow coloring because it's the best that you can get for quality enhancement. I'm gonna show you how it looks in a second. And choosing the right color correction is really important because if you use a high quality color correction, your edits are gonna look way better and it's gonna give it a final good touch. Make sure to put your coloring on a new adjustment layer. To create a new adjustment layer, press Ctrl, Alt and Y on your keyboard. Once you've done that, you can just drag your coloring on here. And this is my personal coloring that I use that you can get on my website right now. As you can see by the usage of a good color correction, you can increase the quality of your TikToks insanely. Here's another clip where you can actually see how much the coloring does to your edit. But don't even worry, I also made a free color correction on my website that you can use with no cost at all. You don't need any plugins for this and I have it on my website so make sure to get it right now, the link's in my description. And as you can see it also makes the quality of your edit way better. So make sure to don't miss out because it's not going to be there forever and get it right now. Once you've completed all the previous steps and edit your color correction, the last thing that's there to do is to render your edit. So I'm going to show you what render settings I use now. Add your edit to your render queue. Now first click where it says best settings and make sure these are all like mine. I'm going to put the quality to best the resolution to full and that's about what you need. Press OK once you've done that and open lossless and change the format from AYI to QuickTime. Also apply all the other settings that I have just like me and press OK. Now you're done and you can render your edit. Once your edit finished rendering, make sure everything worked and you're good to go to upload on TikTok. If this tutorial helped you, make sure to like and subscribe and also share to a friend who has poor quality in his edits. And if you want to join my Discord server, you can chat with me there 24-7. I'm online always. You can ask me questions or just have fun with me. Make sure to join my Discord. The link's also in the bio and see you next time.